Hey y'all, Andrew Bateman here with Trailway Testimonials, and today we're going to revisit the Seabrook Trail System. Now in my opinion, the Seabrook Trail System is a hidden gem. It's among one of the most well-executed trailways I've seen outside of the state park system itself. Now I'd stopped here years ago when development was still in its infancy, and honestly I found the experience to be more that of a serene pocket park rather than an established trailway. But this month, an injury to my rotator cuff caused me to seek temporary means of exercise outside the gym, which led me back to the Seabrook Trailway. And I've got to say that I'm glad that it did. I had no idea how substantial this trail system had become given its unassuming demographic. It's one of those places that makes you forget where you are. It seemed every time I assumed I was at the end of one path, another would appear to meander to some new destination. Now the grounds provide a great wilderness feel that to my knowledge you can't find anywhere else nearby with the exception perhaps of Challenger Park. Now there's also the occasional bench, pier, or picnic table at which to pause. There are scenic stopping points from which to take in the tranquility of an ebbing creek, arching sections of vegetation, sun-soaked straightaways, and even several bamboo gardens mixed in with the native greenery. Now some optional bits of the path are a bit rugged, but the majority is well graded and maintained as evidenced by the occasional jogger negotiating the paths with ease. It's likewise a great place for families. The occasional marker has location information should an emergency situation arise so that first responders can easily access one's location. The trailway is also bordered by a handful of well-maintained parks featuring basketball courts, baseball diamonds, restroom facilities, and even a skate park. There's also a very nice frisbee golf course and lap loops along the path if that's your thing. As far as the wildlife, you can expect to see the occasional rabbit or whitetail and an abundance of turtles in the waterways. On this day, I encountered one friendly snake. However, I have seen both cottonmouths and corals on the path, so do exercise caution, especially with inquisitive little ones. Now, there are several smaller access points to the park, as well as a large lot at North Meyer and Toddville Road. All in all, I have to say that the Seabrook Trail System surpassed my every expectation. The closest thing nearby would be the trails of Armand Bayou and perhaps that of Challenger Park. But beyond that, you're probably looking at an hour drive for such an experience. I do highly recommend checking out the Seabrook Trailway if you're in the Webster, Kima, Friendswood, or Pearland area. Thank you all for watching, hike smart, and God bless.